Part of a busy trail in D.C. is closed tonight because of sewage that leaked onto it after this week's storm. The Capitol Crescent Trail is closed between Water Street and Fletcher's Cove. Horace Holmes is there now live with the word on how long that's going to stay closed. Horace, what is the word there? Well, it's going to be a little while yet, and we've got a very, very stern warning from the U.S. Park Service for folks to stay off the trail here behind me. As you can see, D.C. water is here right now, and they've even had to put up barricades here to keep people out. As bikers, boaters, and runners tried to make their way onto the Crescent Trail today, they were abruptly stopped. Normally on a day like today, people take off work and they come down and, you know, they launch and, and they enjoy the sunshine, but you can't because it's disgusting. The U.S. Park Service has shut down the trail on the D.C. end from Fletcher's Cove to Water Street in Georgetown. This week's flood caused a break in a pipe in part causing 5 million gallons of raw sewage to spill into the Potomac and the overflow onto the trail. You can definitely tell when you're riding. It's, um, you know, it's a little bit funky. I guess you can smell it, but you can see it. I mean, it's just super soupy and thick. You know, it's not it's not the river that we know right now. From the parallel CNO Canal Trail, you can see DC water crews working to clean sewage off the Crescent Trail and fix the broken pipe. The problem, according to the Park Service, is keeping people off the popular Crescent that can be accessed countless ways. An untreated overflow has potential for a lot of contamination, contains a variety of pathogens that uh, carry illnesses, anything from E. coli to hepatitis. And because of how toxic the spill is, the Park Service is warning everyone for the next 24 hours to avoid contact with the Potomac, not to fish downstream from the leak, and sanitize everything that might come in contact with river water. But still, there are people who are not listening to the warnings. Uh, not me. <laughs> <laughs> Plenty of other places to ride. Good idea. This is a very serious situation. Park Service says that they're going to keep this closed. DC Water says it should be about a week before they have everything cleaned up. Reporting live in Georgetown, Horace Holmes, ABC 7 News. Oh.